everyone and welcome back to Aloha Jen's Beauty Blog. For those of you that are new here, hi, my name is Jen and I am a licensed esthetician in the state of California. Well, welcome to, I think it is episode two or three of the Summer Glow Up series. Today is Sunday, the 11th of June, and it's been a busy weekend. <laughs> Um, yeah, I've just been so busy. I, you know, I have been really focusing on myself, um, through diet, exercise, mentally, physically, spiritually, and I feel amazing. Um, so first update is I am down a total of 17 pounds. Woohoo! <laughs> Um, so the body love program is really working for me. It keeps my energy levels up. I feel healthier. My skin looks healthier. Um, just all the way around, I'm losing weight. I have so much energy. It's just been amazing. So for those of you who don't know what the body love program is, I'll put a picture up here of the book. So it's by Kelly Levesque. She is a nutrition nutritionist, but she is now called a celebrity nutritionist because she works with a number of celebrities um, with her plan. And her plan is called the Fab Four, which is at every meal you have protein, fiber, greens, and fat. Well, mainly with your main meals, and then you can have snacks in between, but the ideal is to just pretty much eat three meals a day and use these simple snacks, such as like maybe olives, some nut butter. There's other things that you can add in to help keep you satiated and to keep your blood sugars um, like stable. So I have been um, on the Body Love program now for uh, three weeks. And what really prompted me to get on plan with this was because I stepped on the scale and I saw the number and it completely freaked me out. Um, I was avoiding the scale for quite some time because I didn't want to see the number on there. And I just felt, you know, myself not feeling good. I wasn't I look in the mirror and I didn't like myself and the body love program really works for me. It's just that you have to be ready for it because it is a lifestyle change. It's more of on the lines of a paleo style diet. And so I implemented the changes and I'm down 17 pounds and um, I, this is kind of TMI, but I, I'll, I'll let you guys know. Um, so, you know, women, you know, typically when they're in perimenopause or even just women in general, they have a tendency to get constipated and they only make a bowel movement sometimes once a day. When you're healthy and your body is optimally functioning, you should be making at least three, between two to three bowel movements a day. And I am now up to three bowel movements a day. That's crazy. <laughs> and that's all I'm going to say about that because I don't want to get in too deep. But I just feel great. Um, I've been doing the block therapy. The block therapy has been amazing for me along with body love program. Because the block therapy, I'll give you, for those of you who don't know what it is, it you use this... Um, bamboo block that is provided when you purchase a starter program. I didn't bring mine in here, but I've showed it before. There's two block buddies. There's a, a baby block buddy, and then there's the block buddy. I purchased the starter program with just the block buddy. And you get a program, it's nine days, and you can stay within this program for as long as you'd like. They even give you tips on what to expect when you're um, going through block therapy. Like if you have a rib release, sometimes it can be quite painful. Um, also how you can use the block around the, the house to help release fascia tension. So block therapy, block therapy focuses on these deep fascia adhesions that are adhered to the bone. And when they're adhered to the bone, they create blockages and reduction in circulation, lymphatic fluid. So blood flow isn't optimally moving through these areas. <clears throat> 
which, you know, causes a lot of pain. It causes your muscles not to um, get repaired like how they should. Also, if you've been working out, lifting weights, working on a, your six pack abs, these fascia adhesions will keep you from noticing true results. And what happens is when you have these deep fascia adhesions and you're not breathing properly, it's like you're losing weight, but you're not seeing that definition. Maybe your waistline is expanding. You can't get a flat tummy. You're not, your knees um, are looking a little bit saggier. You're getting cellulite. Your arms are, you know, you're getting the bat wings, like what we call underneath the arm flab. And when you release these fascia adhesions, it allows everything to go back to where it was. Blood flow starts moving through the body properly. Oxygen, nutrients, and all that good stuff is starting to flow through these areas. You can move really, really well. And what these deep um, fascia adhesions are, and I'll give you an example, is um, you've heard me talk about the deep fascia holds with the Omna. So basically, you take you know the Omna and you're holding it in these certain spots where you have these fascia bands that adhere to the bone for three minutes because that's how long it takes for the fascia to recognize that it needs to be released. Well, you take the bamboo block and you hold it in these certain areas, like you lay on it, like you're, there's a couple belly positions, there's rib positions, there's leg position, calf positions, and you put pressure on that area for a total of three minutes to release that tension. And it is absolutely amazing. Now, I've suffered from chronic pain for several years because of my accident that I was in. And I've had this pain in my shoulder for like the last six months. When I go get it massaged, it won't, it won't go out. And I've had it looked at and it's just muscle knots is what the doctor says and they wanna just give me medication. So I was taking like a lacrosse ball and you know working in my shoulder, but I couldn't get it to get out and it was causing me to have frozen shoulders. So once I started block therapy with the starter program using the block buddy and working positions underneath my arm and my ribs, the pain released and now I can move freely. I'm more flexible. Um, it's improved my performance. My belly is starting to get flatter now, and I'm just, I just feel absolutely amazing. And, you know, I'm not here to influence you guys. I'm here to share with you things that can be life changing, improve your life, or help you with your skincare. But I want to show you that, you know, when you're thinking about your facial skin, you have to look at your body as a whole. And that's what I'm trying to be an example here and inspire you guys, because to truly see a difference and to age gracefully or to go through healthy aging, we have to look at all these things, diet, exercise, you know, fascia release, our skincare, our devices that we're using, are these devices hindering our results? Are they causing damage to our skin? So that's why you keep he always hearing me talk about the Jane Man Omna for fascia release. And you're hearing me talk about like diet, exercise, and uh, block therapy because it's truly things that are going to improve your life and I'm not here to sell you something, okay? So um, let's talk about Adipo really quick. I have my extra bottle here. So I have my red LED light therapy and my Adipo along with my, my Salma Green Ribose products um, in the other room in a box with my uh, light therapy because um, I do it first thing in the morning. Now, the last two days, um, so yesterday and today, which is Sunday, I have not done um, red light therapy. I only wanna do it at least five days a week. I don't wanna do it any more than that because I don't wanna risk burnout of my skin because that's what can happen with red LED light therapy is when you're using it too frequently, like more than the manufacturer's instructions, you can cause burnout in the skin and you won't be seeing those results and sometimes it can hinder your results. 
Now with the Enduro devices, they say you can use them five days a week at first for like a month, and then you can go back into a maintenance phase of using it like three days a week, but I want more results. So I'm using them five days a week. Now my Adipo, I keep getting questions about my results. Well, you know, I don't really have a before or after picture, but if you go back to when I started, maybe my new year, new you series and my spring reset series, you could see a difference in my skin. Like the biggest difference that I see is right here underneath my eyes. The, my under eyes are starting to fill in right in through here from the outside in. And they're a lot brighter, which means that, that those fat cells are regenerating. And I'm noticing some results here in this area. Now I put Adipo all over and I even put it underneath here because Ivan says wherever you see facial sagging, you want to apply Adipo. And in order to treat your mouth area right in through here, you do have to put it on your cheeks. And so that's what I do. I even put it on my earlobes because my earlobes were starting to look pretty sad. <laughs> so, and it's like plumping them back up. Now, the thing with Adipo is that you have to find the best application for you in order to see results. And everybody's going to see results differently with Adipo. Some will notice it, you know, within four to eight weeks. Some, it may take months. Now, for me, where I've seen the best results with Adipo is just using it um, as a mask and not leaving it on my skin overnight. Because what happens with me is when I leave the Adipo on for like over 10 minutes, like say I've had it on for an hour, it starts coming down here and gets into my eyes because I do put it on my forehead, but I don't put a lot in there and I put it right here in between my brows because we do have a fat pad right here. Now, I found the best technique for me is to, after my red LED light therapy in the morning, I just apply it on top of my skin as a mask and I wear it for at least 10 minutes. Today I had it on for two hours, yesterday I had it on for two hours, and then what I do is yesterday what I did is I took a soft cloth and I removed it from my skin that way and applied my SPF over the top of it and I was fine. But I wouldn't recommend doing that if you plan on wearing makeup because it will make your skin oily. Now, when I am during the week when I'm going to work and I'm gonna wear makeup, I completely remove the adipo, I cleanse it off my skin, and I go in with my morning skincare routine, and that's it. Um, at night, when I was using it twice a day, I would cleanse my skin first, apply adipo, leave it on for 10 minutes, cleanse my skin again, and then follow through with my nighttime skincare routine. Now, depending on your skincare, you can apply Adipo over those products in the evening and use it as your nighttime moisturizer. Just leave it on the skin for about 10 minutes and then you can rub it in or wipe it off with a nice soft cloth and apply your nighttime moisturizer. But what you have to take into consideration is that there are oils in here and it could have a tendency to block some of those ingredients from penetrating. That's why what I have found for me to see my best results is just using it as basically a mask on its own. But you will find your way. I say test it in the different ways, like I mentioned, and find what best suits you. Now, with the Zip Halo, I purchased the little zip case along with another bottle of the Electrical Complex Gel. I have been enjoying this Electrical Complex Gel simple formulation and it's only $25 for 2.7 ounces versus I have the silver gel here which is $50 for 2.7 ounces and um, I love the silver gel and I do love this formula. I do not like the other two formulas which is the crystal gel and the golden gel that I find I get a lot of irritation. So I have been, I've tested all the programs here in the zip 
and I can use every single one of them without causing any um, problems in my skin. Now, I am currently on the six-day event program. I decided let's try this baby route with a plan. I will tell you that I'm on day four and using the zip back to back, actually I'm on day five, for doing microcurrent every single day, it's caused some tension in my muscles. And that's why I like to take a break off in between because even though I'm releasing the surface fascia, I really feel like now I have to go in and do those deep fascia holds because where I'm feeling a lot of tension is actually here in my cheeks and around my mouth. Now today, I'm supposed to do the jowl program. So I was gonna do that with you guys here um, on camera. Now, I, I will tell you, um, the Pico Toner is still my favorite way to perform microcurrent. I love the Pico Toner because you can do some really good fine tuning with that P1 program, the Lift and Tone. You can do some really good lifting and you can really get in there to the muscle belly and make a difference in that lift. Um, I love that on the P1 program, you can do, um, they call it their erase mode or their erase technique to work on your fine lines and wrinkles and to also help um, uh, with sun damage. Now, P2, I absolutely love because that program works in the skin by helping with cell regeneration, skin density, skin radiance, moving lymph out, and it also works in your connective tissue, which is the fascia. So the Pico Toner is still my number one um, microcurrent device with the Jane Man Lift. I love the zip for a quick, treatment it's very easy to use all the programs are very doable um you know they're they range anywhere from two to ten minutes and if you're on a time crunch and you want to get in your microcurrent treatment you can do that with the zip i i think it's a great device to travel with i love this new halo i see a bigger difference in my skin than i did with my gx so this is a winner for me and it's my new favorite handheld microcurrent device. Now, with this, you know, it is, you know, slide and glide, but you still see a difference. This is great for those of you who find the Pico Toner is too cumbersome and you want something easy, you don't have a lot of time. Um, it's just very, very easy and it will still make a difference in your skin. Now, I will have to tell you that my favorite programs so far with this are definitely Deep, Deep Huff. I love Plump. Plump is amazing. I love the Eyes program. I love Lift. So Lift is really a nice lifting program because it's using microcurrent and nanocurrent at the same time. And what's really nice about it is that when you're doing that lift treatment is that the nanocurrent is really working in your skin to help with skin radiance and skin plumpness. And it just, I just, you really notice a difference with it and your skin looks like you just had a facial. So this is like having a facialist in your hand. And I just really love that Zip listened to us and made these changes in the device. Now, the one thing I will say I wish it still had is that intensity control because I do find that instant, grat instant gratification, even though I didn't get any muscle twitching with it, it still feels a little bit strong and that's why my face, face muscles are tight from doing that. But however, I am gonna go in and do the gels program now. So let's go ahead and do that. So I'm going to apply the um, electrical complex gel. So maybe I'm gonna start off with actually the eyes program, and then I'll go into the gels program. So with this electrical complex gel, it says to use seven pumps, or I'm sorry, 10 pumps, but I find like seven or less is good. You just have to see how your skin is. Maybe right now 
I'll have to use a little bit more because I am, I've been sitting here talking um, without anything on my skin. So what I do love about the zip gels is you don't have to worry about reapplying them. They stay really slippery on the skin. Your skin's not really going in and absorbing it. So I'm going to go in with the eyes program right now. And then there, from there, we'll go into the gels program and then we can see how this works. So I will turn up the volume on my iPad and let the app do the talking and then I'll screen record it and put the video on the side here. We're going to treat the eyes now. You need to have your conductive gel all the way down under the cheekbone, <clears throat> all the way up here and on your eyelids as well. So I'm going to set my globes down right here and I'm going to slowly pull until I feel the vibration. And then we're going to gently touch down and do this again. And gently touch down. Now I like to pull my brow open, but if you want to shape more cat eye like that, you can pull out like that or you can keep pulling up like this. You can see it's already opening my eye, which is really my objective, but it's about what you're looking for. So if you want to pull this way, you can pull this way, or you can pull up. You just use that vibration to remember to start a new stroke. Okay, we'll move to the other side. Gently touching down. Pull. Okay. And I'm ever so slightly pulling. You don't want to use much pressure at all. The, the current is doing the work for you. So I like to even out towards the other eye, so I just will keep pulling up, up, up until I've got my eyes even. All done. So as you guys can see is that my zip <laughs> goes faster or slower than the actual video. And she does mention that, you know, this program is meant to be sort of like freehand, so you don't have to follow along. And what I like to do is I'll do five moves of go pulling up my eyebrow, and then I'll switch and do five of this cat eye one. And then I'll switch and do up here to open up my brow more. And on this one where I'm opening up my brow, I'm slower than the actual program. Um, so I don't, the, it buzzes before I actually get up to my brow. And I'm not sure why this is longer on mine. So because the program is supposed to be two minutes and I'm like well over two minutes now. So maybe, maybe it's something with my zip but we'll test it out on another program. As you can see, like this is going pretty long. Okay, 
So there's my eyes. They look way more lifted. All right, so now let's go into the gels program. It's three minutes. All right, for this treatment, we wanna make sure we've got our conductive gel layer okay. all the way throughout here, and don't forget, under the jawline as well. Okay. So for this very first pull, you're gonna hold right here in the attachment until you feel the vibration. Okay, now we're gonna do that again. And then I'm holding right here until I feel the vibration. Right here, you don't wanna push up, you just wanna hold at the attachment. Okay. Okay, now I'm moving out just a bit and holding, like turning my halo a little bit upside down. And now I'm moving out just a bit more and holding right here. Moving out just a bit more and I'm holding until the vibration all right, now we're back to a restorative. This is double the intensity. Yeah, it is. So we're holding for the vibration. Once again, we're going to do this three times. So this is the second. And I'm waiting for the vibration. And last one. And I'm turning my okay. globes. See, mine goes faster right, next side. than hers. All right, so I'm holding right there. And again. So slightly and hold right here and wait for the vibration and then move out just a bit more and turn up and hold for the vibration and then I'm going to come at more of a diagonal right here and I'm holding when this vibration comes, I'm going to move back to my starting point, but it's double time. So this is double the intensity. One. We're going to do this three times. So that was the first vibration. There's the second. Okay. So I should have gotten one more on there, so I kind of messed up. But... I mean, I can't really see anything with my jowls. Maybe in a little bit I will. We'll see. But there you go. That's my treatment for today. <laughs> now, tomorrow, I believe it is... Um, I can't remember. But what I have noticed, like I said, with doing this like every single day in a row is that these muscles feel really tired and overworked. So I'm going to have to do some nice tension release in here and I will probably do that after these six days. So I should be finishing up here on Tuesday um, after this is complete. And then I took a before picture and I'll take an after picture and we can compare the results. So I'm gonna actually go jump in the shower right now. I'm going to smooth out my hair today because tomorrow I'm working, it's a Monday, and I wanna do a deep conditioning treatment on my hair. I'm gonna do my purple shampoo um, and do a deep conditioning treatment on my hair using the Olaplex products. 
And when I deep condition my hair, I usually don't like to wash it for a few days after. So I can just let everything, you know, penetrate my hair and just repair. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to come back and um, after I'm out of the shower and I'm going to demonstrate the Dyson Air Straight for you guys. I'll do a little demo of how I like to use it. And then I'm not gonna film my complete routine with it because it's gonna be way too long. And I I need help with seeing the back of my hair when I use that because my hair is curly and I wanna make sure that I get out all that wave. And then that will be it for this video. So it's kind of sort of like a little catch up, get ready with me, except for I'm not wearing makeup today. I'm just doing like a little nice Sunday skincare routine. So I will see you in a bit. Hey, I'm back. <laughs> I'm fresh and clean. So I went ahead and applied my skincare. It's my daytime routine that I showed you from my video uh, last week. Now, my skin looks really, really good. And actually, my jowls look pretty good from doing that jowls program with the zip. So a um, couple things that I wanted to talk to you guys about is, before we get into the Dyson Air Straight, is... Have you tried the Trader Joe's Brazil Nut um, line? I have all three products, the body scrub, the body butter, and the body wash, and I love all three. They're only $5.99 each. However, these are limited edition. So I did stock up on some, and I the only thing I wasn't able to stock up on was the body scrub. I got two body scrubs. I'm almost finished with one but I got a couple more body butters and a couple more body washes. I love, love, love. So this body butter is really nice and light. It's not that heavy. It pretty much absorbs into the skin. Um, it has a light scent to it. It's, what is it? A delightful salted caramel and pistachio scent. I get little hints of the caramel, but it's it's kind of fruity and a little bit warm, but it's so lovely. Every time I wear this, I get so many compliments on it. Now, this is just like that Sol de Janeiro, um, the Brazilian Bum Bum line, So, but it's a lot cheaper. It's not as um, heavy with the fragrance as that line is, and this has extracts instead of um, synthetic scents in it. So I have been loving this line. I would suggest if you haven't already, go check out your local Trader Joe's to see if they still have it and pick it up and try it. The body wash is so creamy. I use it for to shave my legs. I just really love the way that these products make my skin feel. I wish they were available year round. So let's, I'm gonna show you my block from Block Therapy. I know I've showed you this before. So when you order your starter package with Block Therapy, they send you the block um, package that you chose, whether it be the Block Buddy or the Block Buddy and the Block Baby or the Baby Block. So when you get it, it comes in this box. There is a little message here in the box. And then your block buddy is in this really pretty velvet pouch. And then this is what you use to store your uh, block in. So the blocks are made out of bamboo because bamboo is the material that's closest that mimics our bones to get in there to really truly release those fascia adhesions. Now these are expensive. So you can't buy these um, without getting a starter package. And once you get the starter package, you can pick up like the baby block later on. So they're $119. So if you get both of them, you're saving, I think like $19 or something, or maybe $40 if you were to purchase them another one separately. Now they're going to release their uh, face lifting program and it's a bamboo paddle that you use to release tension around your face and neck and other areas. Now that's gonna be released on this Tuesday, June 13th, I believe. They have a limited amount of them. I'm going to try to pick it up. I'm not for sure if I'm gonna be able to, um, depending on the price of it, because if it's gonna be a you know, $147. I don't think I'm gonna be able to um, pick that up because I'm getting my hair done here. 
next week and that's going to cost a lot so <laughs> i'm going to get it colored i just got it cut um not too long ago so um with that though i mean there's nothing fancy about it and i know like you're thinking like oh i spent 150 bucks and this is all i get you know um there's no special note or anything like that but i will tell you that i have um you know reached out to deanna and quinn personally and they're very responsive in their um, Instagram DMs. They're very, very, um, really good, good people. Now, if you are interested in block therapy and you want to see if it's right for you, I would suggest researching their YouTube videos. Watch them because this is an investment and only investment in it if you think you're going to use it. It's been life changing for me and I highly recommend it. That's why you keep hearing me talk about it because it has improved my life overall such a great deal truly life-changing now let's get into my hair so um by the way today i uh forgo um spf because i'm giving my skin a break i um i went for my walk early this morning and if i go outside anymore today i'm just gonna put a hat on because i have to give my skin a break at least once a week from sunscreen that's just how it goes with me um that's just my thing you don't have to do that but that's what i do so what did i put in my hair so i washed my hair with the olaplex 4c clarifying shampoo i like to use this about every three weeks with their 4p um, blonde enhancing shampoo to brighten up my blonde and take out the brassiness. So I go in and clarify my scalp first and anytime you're using a blonde shampoo, it's always recommended that you clarify your hair and your scalp first so this works better. Now I only use this every three weeks. You don't use it once a week, you don't use it every other week. You use it about every three weeks. That's what my stylist tells me and I notice bigger results with this. So I did that and then I went in with the Olaplex number eight Bond Intense Moisture Mask. Left that on my hair while I shaved and did all that fun stuff. And then to style my hair for styling products, I went in with the Virtue um, Volumizing Mousse. And then I went in with my mid shaft to my ends, the Olaplex number nine. This is their Nourishing Hair Serum. Did this, this is what I'm using for my heat protectant. When I use, you know, certain products like Olaplex, I like to use all their products together. I just notice better results. Then I did a cocktail of their number six bond smoother and their number seven bonding oil and put that all through my hair. So this does not have heat protectant in it. This has heat protectant in it and so does the number nine. So if you're heat styling your hair and using this, you have to use a heat protectant. So next, I just put my hair up in sections, but before I did that, I went in with the air straight um, on wet mode and just kind of blew out my roots a little bit. And then now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna work on this section first and my hair is already almost drying because the Olaplex number nine makes my hair dry really fast. So I'm just going to take this section here and I'm going to take the Dyson Air Straight, turn it on. Now every time you turn it on, it goes into cleaning mode. And then I'm gonna go into wet mode and I'm gonna go to two, oops, that's dry mode. Wet mode. And I'm gonna go to 230. So the heats are one, 175, 230, and 285. So I'm gonna go 230. And what I'll do is I close this and I'm gonna blow dry my room. So I take that and I blow dry my root first, then I'm going to clamp it on my hair and run it slowly through one pass.
Okay, so that, it feels pretty dry. I'm gonna go through a second time. Okay, so it's pretty dry with just those two passes but I want some additional smoothing. So what I'm gonna do is I go switch to dry mode and I'm gonna turn it to boost, okay? And then I do one pass of boost. Okay, so after I do that one pass of boost, I turn it to cool mode, and I'm gonna do one pass of cool mode to set this section. And voila, look at how straight my hair is. Now when I set this down, it's gonna turn off. Now the reason why I do this the way I do it, I do two passes on wet mode at 2.30, then I switch over to dry mode on use it on boost and go one pass and then a cool mode, is that I find that this gives me the best longest lasting style. If I just went through each hair strand on wet mode at 2.30, then I um, did cool. I don't, my style doesn't last that long. And this gives me the best, smoothest results and my hair will stay like this until I wash it. I won't even need to go in tomorrow to actually go in and refresh this. This will be so beautifully straight. I just love it. Now with the Dyson Air Straight, I'm gonna turn it off here for a second. I don't recommend it for those of you who have straight hair. This, I mean, if you have straight hair, I don't think this is you have a need for this unless you want it. If you have wavy or curly hair like I do, I think you will love this. It is so good. This is the only tool that I've used to where I can keep my hair this straight until I wash it without getting my curl back. Um, all my other tools, even my flat iron, when I go to sleep or I come into contact with moisture, my hair will curl back up in certain sections. If you do what I did to get this piece, two passes on a uh, wet mode, one pass on dry mode boost and cool shot, you will get great results. Now, um, this, I did time it the last few times I've used it and it actually does take me a little bit longer to smooth out my hair, but however, I only have to use one tool. So typically it takes me about anywhere from 45 minutes to 50 minutes to straighten my hair. Um, I blow dry my roots and then I go in with my blow dryer brush. If I was to flat iron my hair, it would take me probably about an hour because I have to blow out my hair completely dry and then go in with the flat iron. Now, with the blow dryer brush, I just blow out my roots and then go through my hair. And it takes me roughly about 40, 40, we'll say 40, 45 minutes. This takes me about 45 minutes to do my hair. Now, what I love about this is that there's no hot plates, it's just using that air. But with a blow dryer brush, you're constantly combing through your hair. With this, you're not. So in that aspect, it's not damaging on your hair. It's actually healthier. And my hair feels so healthy, so soft and shiny. Every time I use this, I took this um, with me when I got my hair cut a couple of weeks ago and I had my hairstylist use it on my hair because she wanted to try it. So she used it on my hair and she says, for the consumer, she likes it, but not for her as a professional. Um, she, but she said that what she loved about it is how healthy and soft and shiny my hair was after. 
And um, I do notice that. So of course, if you use this every day, like if you're someone who uses a flat iron every day, this will be better for your air. I mean, for your air, for your hair, because it's just, uh, you know, it's air and it's not as hot as a flat iron. But if you go in the next day and say you keep refreshing your hair on dry mode and boost, you're going to get damage from it because it's heat. So any device that you're using on your hair that has heat in it, styling tools, it's going to cause some damage. That's why it's really important that you use proper products to protect your hair. Your hair can even get damaged if you don't put any products in your hair and you let it air dry. So it does cause damage with that way too. So in that aspect, it is less damaging on the hair. Now, one thing I will say, so this is $4.99, so it's 500 bucks, okay? What I was disappointed about with this purchase is that with my other Dyson tools, I got some sort of a case. This, the only thing I got was this rubber pad and they didn't include the case. And I thought that was really chintzy of them. And my husband said, well, you know, inflation, everything's gone up. So they were trying to keep the price the same and this is what they could do. So this thing is like, I keep it out on my counter. It's awkward to store because I don't have a case for it. So now I have to buy a case for it separately, but I am keeping it. I'm so in love with it. And I think those of you who have curly hair, if you're interested in it, I would suggest it. Now, the thing is, is with this, it's only going to straighten your hair. You can't put any curl or bend in your hair with it. It's just to straighten it, but you can curl your hair after. And sometimes that's what we do. It's like when I am going to curl my hair, I have to completely smooth it out before I put curls in it because of the, my curls, it's not gonna look right. So I wanted to pop that, I wanted to pop in and you know give you my thoughts on the Dyson Air Straight and show you a quick demo of it. Now I'm gonna go finish my hair and I'll come back and show you what my hair looks like after. So I'll see you in a bit. Okay, so here is my hair after with using the Dyson Air Straight. You see how straight I got my hair? So nice and smooth. My hair feels so silky and soft. It is so shiny. Whenever I use any other straightening device, blowout brush, uh, flat iron, my hair is never this shiny and it's never this soft or straight. It just feels so good. It feels so nice and healthy. So there we go. So I will sleep in this overnight and it will look like this tomorrow morning. Now, usually what I do, what I like to do is um, to keep my hairstyle, I usually like to sleep in a satin cap. So I do have silk pillowcases that I sleep on at night, but um, to keep my hair from losing shape, I do sleep on this sometimes. And with this, I've slept with it and without it. And my hair just really just still looked great the next day. I was able to keep the style. So now what you can do if you want more volume, you can go in with Velcro rollers and you can just roll the crown of your head if you'd like. But I just really love the Air Straight. It's the best for my hair to smooth it out. Now this took me 35 minutes after I did that initial test for you guys. But yeah, it's so good. All right guys, so that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed this check-in and if there and I will see you guys in the next one. I'm hoping maybe I can pop on Tuesday but we will see. I'm sending you all so much love and light, and I hope that you have a beautiful week ahead if I don't see you. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Bye. See you in the next one. Hey, now, take a step outside and seize the day.